In this video, we'll cover General Motors' new Global A architecture and why you should not swap control modules. Main reason being, both vehicle and or control damage may occur. The Global A architecture was introduced on select 2010 models and does not allow control modules to be swapped between vehicles. The swapping of control modules will result in a no-star condition on both vehicles and will damage both modules due to the new vehicle security protocol. It started with the 2010 models listed here, the Chevrolet Camaro, Chevrolet Equinox, the Buick La Crosse, the Cadillac SRX, and the GMC Terrain. 2011 models added this system include the Chevrolet Cruze, the Chevrolet Volt, and the Buick Regal. In 2012, the Buick Verano, the Chevrolet Sonic, and the Chevrolet Orlando added the GM Global A architecture system. And in 2013, the Cadillac ATS, the Cadillac XTS, the Chevy Malibu, Chevrolet Captiva, and Chevrolet Spark. When you're using the GM Global A architecture, the following controllers cannot be swapped. Now this is a pretty big list. I'm not going to read through them all, but you can see it's uh, quite a few of them. And of course, GM will be introducing more models with this system as the years go on. And if you're not sure if your vehicle or the controller you're working with has the Global A architecture, please contact the General Motors support line. Some of the information I gathered in this video is from the GM TechLink publication from the February 2010 and February 2012. And for all your J2534 programming needs, be sure to contact us, us here at Ease Diagnostics, and you could reach us at www.obd2.com or j2534reprogrammer.com, or just call us on our toll-free line or a regular landline. Thank you.